disgusted with the shinobi world. Disgusted with death and war. All that drove me was the thought of a peaceful shinobi world. That scum Donzo said there couldn't be peace, even after our clan came to a conclusion. What a sick, twisted man burdens one to choose between blood and years of legacy, but he had hintages of his own. Contracting a terminal illness during my travels with the Akatsuki sealed my fate. As did the slaughtering of my clan. I put that ring on my finger knowing what I had done. Knowing that Shisui died for nothing. But still, I had only one goal I was determined to fulfill. And that was to die by Sasuke's hand. Once I felt my illness bringing me to the last bit of life I had, I drove Sasuke into a corner. Drove out Orochimaru, killed him, and stopped the curse mark seal of heaven from taking over my brother's body. I died, loving my brother in the end. Still a faithful ninja to the leaf and a murderer in Sasuke's eyes. The Akatsuki tried destroying the leaf, but failed. Not long after that, Madara Uchiha was resurrected, and with that brought along the Third Great Ninja War. I rose from the dead due to reanimation. I broke that hold over me due to Shisui's left eye. <laughs> Even after death, he played a part of bringing peace in the shinobi world. Me and Sasuke reunited again. I said my last and final goodbyes. Naruto took good care of Sasuke in the end. And now, the Uchiha lives through you. Let's hope I don't have to be brought back a second time. All of my life, I've tried to be the perfect son, the perfect ninja. Sasuke, my foolish, foolish little brother, I slaughtered our family, our entire clan. But I'm going to be assigned missions soon, assigned and starting missions. tomorrow you'll be attending the Ninja Academy, so we aren't going to have as much free time to ourselves anymore. It's okay, as long as you can still spend time with me once in a while. <laughs> and for what? For what? For what? For what?